What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. So today I'm wearing my glasses because girl this is a late night with low. I don't want to have to put on makeup at 9.42 to do this video. It's a nail video. The most you're going to see is my nails. You're not going to be looking at my face. Plus I already have gone on YouTube with no makeup on so there's nothing new here girl. I'm so sorry about the glare though. These are really cheap glasses so they don't got the non-glare. I want to get like a pair of the clear glasses with a really good lens. I got these as a backup and I just never switch into something better. What is Late Night with Low? This is going to be I think a segment. Again, my channel is really new so I'm not really sure where I'm going with the series or the kinds of videos on my channel. All I know is that I love to try things. That's one of the things that I actually love to do. And I like to DIY, experiment at home, create. I'm very crafty, I would say, or I enjoy attempting crafts and projects and art things. So today I'm attempting to do my own nails. Girl, I'm tired. I'm tired of not having nails. I feel like I need to feel the clickety clack. Necesito, como que? I need that in my life. If not, I feel like I'm not as put together. It's been two months. I had acrylics on when quarantine, I believe, started. I took them off because they looked horrendous after like a month. All the gel polishes and the UV or the LEDs or the sign sign light that cures the gel polish, they're like sold out or they're gonna get here in like June. And ain't nobody got time for that, girl. You know, I'm the type of person that if I wanna do something right now, I'm gonna move sky, earth, and heaven until I get what I'm after. So I have my vlog camera. Hey guys at the vlog camera. Hello, hi, how you doing? Soon when I get my acrylics on, I'm gonna be doing all of that. I'm gonna be talking with my hands. So I have the Complete Salon Acrylic Kit by the brand Kiss. I got this at Walgreens. I paid $22 for this. I like that it has white tips, clear tips, a bunch of stuff. So I said for 20 bucks, if it doesn't work out, I didn't spend too much money. I have a t-shirt on my desk because this has bleach on the other side. I don't want to get acrylic powder or liquid on my table that I film on. Oh, this is cute. Look, you guys, it's a little kit. I love that it comes with a box. So once you're done, you can just store it. And I think down here, you can like pull this out. That's where the tips are. If you guys hear my husband, by the way, I don't even know which camera to look at. He's playing Call of Duty. So I can't, like, I don't feel like telling him to be quiet because without the microphone and his little headphone thing, he thinks the game's whack. So just disregard, you guys. I'm so sorry. This is... A chill video late night with low not too much thought went into this video so i just hope you guys enjoy the very organic natural unplanned type of video like this one my nails are long i don't know if i should keep them long or cut them i'm gonna keep them long only because i might want to take these off and do my natural nails because Necesito mucha energía para lo que yo voy a hacer because I don't have a nail drill, which means I'm going to be stuck on filing for a while. It's about to be 10. It's 9.56. I'm letting you guys know that so that we can see how long it takes me to do this, which I feel is going to be a while. Now we're going to be selecting the nail tips for each individual finger. If needed, file the size of the actual tip for a customized fit, then place them aside in sequence, and then I'm going to put the glue onto the artificial tip and put it on my nail and then hold for five seconds. Then I'm going to shape the nails. This kit has two different types of tips. It has French tip and then the natural tip. I'm going to use natural today. I'm gonna customize this one using the, I guess, rough side. I think one um, pinky of mine is bigger than the other. I forgot to do this to my nail, so I'm just using the fine side and just lightly um, filing so that the nail has enough, um, just grip on the natural nail. 
because I'm trying not to have to refill these or do these for some time. I've seen people do this at the nail salon, so I want to feel extra official. So I'm going to be taking the glue out of the kit. This is the maximum speed nail glue. Okay. I feel like I went OD on that. Oh, God. Oh, Lordy. Oh, Lordy. And then hold for five seconds. Every nail como que cojo fuerza, algo bien hermoso. All right, so I'm gonna continue. I like the, I think I like this method better. She back. Yo, with my nails like this, yo, this just makes me feel good. Like, this is what I was missing. Oh my God. Esta cuarentena se puso buena. Yo, I was having such a sad day today. Like, I even cried like at least 10 times today. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted that today was hard. Then I posted some encouraging verses because God definitely encouraged me today through his word. But these nails are encouraging me right now. I feel like... Bien divina, mi amor. Bien divina. Me encanta. Me siento divina. So ahora, I'm going to be doing my next hand. And then we're going to come back and show you what the next step is. So they're already done. All of my nails are completely um, put on. All the tips are on. Estamos ready to go. So I just have a nail clipper. I'm going to go ahead and trim these to what I want. I kind of want to keep them nice and square, but they can look a little bulky. Mira, ya empecé. Todo te pica, todo lo quiere tocar. I love them. I'm going to bring you to the, to the bottom view so we can continue to work. Okay. Um, definitely don't want them these long, so let me just start cutting these. Hmm. Nah, this is like oldie. Wow, it's that being grande. Oh my gosh, this nail is huge. I feel like this is a little too long. I'm trying to see in the mirror just to see. Maybe with like a coffin shape. I'm just afraid to do coffin shape and then regret it. See, I still feel cute, but they're not as long, so no mucho clickety clack. I figured it's my first time doing acrylic nails and I really don't want to butcher this, so I'm going to keep them short. I just realized I have to file these and shape these to the length and the shape so i'm gonna do that and then we will start putting the acrylic on the nail i'm tapering them in um a little bit Ow, I cut myself so bad with the file. My nails, my skin is so dry. I'm kind of going for like a taper square. Okay guys, so it is 10.35. I just finished shaping my nails por encima, meaning, you know, right above, um, not right above, por encima, me trying to translate Puerto Rican slang and it's not even a direct translation of anything that makes sense. First, I'm gonna put the primer. I'm gonna put this on my natural nail, it says. Now I'm gonna be using the little dish and putting the acrylic inside of the dish. So pretty it's purple and that's exactly why I wanted to use my old t-shirt okay and then it says to put three to five drops of this acrylic masking liquid and it's in the scent apple One. if anybody knows what this does the masking liquid or your nail tech or you've done this before let me know I'm curious so I'm supposed to get a paper towel 
get the brush that comes in the kit. I should probably take the powder out already and open it. So I'm ready. I low-key wish that I would have kept my long nails because, you know, that would have been more like life-changing. So it says to dip the brush in the acrylic liquid to break up the cast, make it soft. I have no idea. The instructions don't seem super clear, so I'm just kind of going to go with it. I'm going to start with my thumb. So I've already let my nails dry. So now I'm just gonna file. I ain't gonna lie you guys, I'm kind of impressed with how this is coming out. Yo guys, mira, not bad. All right, we continue. We're gonna go for the nail color and we're gonna be golden in Jesus name. Yeah, this makes all the difference. I just went, washed my hands, and look at my nails. I mean, not bad, I would say. This is my nails. They don't look bad at all. I feel like I expected worse. Today, we're going to be painting my nails pink. This is a color by Essie. This is called High Maintenance. And then this one is their top coat. And then this is... A base coat that I had a long time ago. Let me show you guys a closer look. My nails don't look terrible. Obviously, they could be better, you know, but I think that for being an at home little manicure situation, not bad. I really wish I would have cut my cuticles and maybe not push the acrylic so back. I'm just afraid that tomorrow it'll look a little crusty. I'm gonna first start with this base coat. Now I'm going in with the high maintenance. This is the color that I'm using. Hopefully I forget if this is sheer or not. If it's sheer, then I'm gonna pick something else. Yeah, it seems sheer. I'm changing my mind, you guys. I think I'm going for this nude. This is by LA Colors. This is Eternal. So you see, this is God's will because it's Eternal. <laughs> All right, wait, let me shake. I hope you guys are ready to see the end result. I have to say, if I had to rate how well or how bad I did, I would say a solid six because from far you can't even tell what's up. And when you get close enough, I would just think that someone did these poorly at a salon. Drum roll, please. Boom. This is what I got, you guys.
And you see, they, they look being chula de, de lejo. Honestly, it's because they're new that they don't really stand out. But I feel like they look clean. I don't got nobody to see anyway, but I had so much fun doing it. It's 12.40 right now, so it was like a good... I think I started at 9.50 or 10.50. I would say two to three hours it took me to do because I was filming. I'm sure if you hustle, you focus, you don't watch YouTube and film, you could get it done in an hour and maybe a half. Honestly, I'm satisfied because what my nails look like before to now, they look pretty good to me. I'm going to show you guys a close-up on my other camera. This is what I got. Some are chunky and, you know, the shapes are a little off, but for a person without a drill, a complete beginner when it comes to anything acrylics, I think that I survived. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up down below. And if you liked me or this kind of content, please subscribe and join my YouTube familia. Turn on the bell so you guys get notified every time that I post. I have a goal of hitting a thousand subscribers. If it's your first time here, check out all the videos that I have on my page. I'm being consistent this time around. I'm uploading at least once a week. My goal is two times a week to upload because I don't want to put out content just to post content. I really want to post content that I'm being myself in and that you guys are enjoying and that I enjoy filming. I will see you guys in the next one. I hope you guys enjoy this late night with Lo. I had so much fun trying this out tonight. If there's anything else you want me to try, let me know in the comments. DM me on Instagram. You can follow me at Loami Music, Loami Music, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Oh, let me come back. Let me come back. Let me come back. I have a goal of reaching 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. Once I hit that goal, YouTube can consider me to be monetized, and that way I can make a little something for each video that I post and I'm able to reinvest back into this channel. I have really wild and really crazy and fun ideas for this channel, content that um, you know requires a lot of investment. So if you'd like to help me reach that goal, it would mean the world to me. You have no idea. Thank you so much for watching this. And another way you can support me is by sharing this on your socials. You don't gotta do no intro. You don't gotta put no caption. There might be someone on your friends list that would enjoy my content. So thank you so much, you guys. Um, I pray that you guys are staying safe that you guys are, um, you know, strong in your faith and you stay encouraged. And I will see you guys in the next one.